Hi, I'm Celestial Cindy from CelestialCindy.com and this YouTube video is a vlog video of our day today. We just now woke up. It is 8.30 a.m. I ate some Reese's chocolates for breakfast and there is Reese's chocolate on my lips right now. And the birds are here, oh my gosh. I see the male hairy woodpecker and I see the tufted titmouse and I see the white-breasted nuthatch. So all of our bird friends are here. Yeah, I just saw the male hairy woodpecker, the little gray tufted titmouse bird and the white-breasted nuthatch bird. I'm going to get the Reese's chocolate off of my lips in a second. I hear all the little birds chirping. Another little bird just flew up just now. What bird is it? I think it was the tufted titmouse. Yeah. So I noticed that I didn't get a lot of views on our uh, bird watching video that I posted on YouTube yesterday. So maybe me and Chibi like to do the bird watching, but maybe you guys on YouTube aren't as interested in the bird videos, lol. But we, me and Chibi are super excited about doing the bird watching. We think that it's fun. I'm gonna check and see if we got any packages. Don't worry, I'm going to get the Reese's chocolate off of my lips here in a second. Yeah, I don't see any packages, but I thought I heard a package delivery truck uh, drive outside at our house. We're checking on our Meyer lemon tree this morning. Uh, I don't know if you can see it. Uh, the Meyer lemon tree looks like it's doing good. So we checked on our favorite little birds. Oh, there's the male hairy woodpecker. Let me see if we can show you. Oh, look, you can see the male hairy woodpecker. We know it's the male hairy woodpecker because he has the little red spot on the back of his head. Oh my gosh. And that's the white-breasted nuthatch, that little blue and gray bird. On the Squirrel Buster Plus, the white-breasted nuthatch just flew away. Oh, there's the tufted titmouse. The tufted titmouse is here. Okay, the tufted titmouse is kind of skittish. The woodpecker is uh, not as skittish as the tufted titmouse and the white-breasted nuthatch. I'm just going to put our camera right here. But we just now woke up. I'm gonna get the Reese's off of my lips. The Reese's chocolate I ate this morning. Oh my gosh, I'm so pale. All right, I'm cleaning the Reese's off of my face. Ah. Well, I hope we got the chocolate mm. off of my lips just now. We just wake up. Good morning, YouTube. channel update this morning. I think this morning I checked our, uh, I opened our YouTube studio app and I checked our watch time. Chibi just burps because he, he breastfed for maybe like 30 minutes just now after I ate the Reese's for breakfast. I checked our, uh, I opened the YouTube studio app and I looked at the watch time in hours and <laughs> anything is funny. And I think we had like 759 watch hours right now on our YouTube channel. So we're super excited 
Um, hopefully we hit a thousand watch hours by tomorrow. So maybe when we wake up tomorrow morning, I can click on the YouTube studio app and maybe it will say 1000 watch hours and me and Chibi will be tickled to death when we hit a thousand watch hours because that'll be our next big gigantic YouTube channel milestone. And we will be super excited. Um, this is a brand new YouTube channel, so we're trying to get to the 4,000 watch hours and the 1,000 subscribers. I think we currently have like maybe 240 subscribers on our YouTube channel and maybe like 759 watch hours. I'm not looking at it right now, but in my mind, the last time I've looked at it, I think those are our current statistics. Chibi's trying to watch the birds. He hears the little birds chirping in the morning. We gotta unzip him and we gotta change his little diaper. All right, I'm about to take Chibi's little um, Hudson baby pajamas off. We received these little pajamas as a gift. Oh, bless you, TV. Oh, so cute. I love this little Hudson baby pajama sleep sack. Sometimes he wears these Hudson baby pajamas and sometimes we put Chibi in the little nested bean pajamas with a little chicken, with a little chicken on the pajamas. But I was on YouTube and I saw one other woman post a video and her YouTube video was called Why I Threw My Nested Bean Sleep Sack in the Trash. And the lady said that she um, put her baby in the nested bean weighted pajamas that had the little chicken that has a little weight on the chest. It's a, some weighted pajamas. And she said that she put her baby in the nested bean weighted pajama sleep sack, but her baby wears an owlet monitor on its foot. And the owlet monitor measures your baby's oxygen saturation and she said that her baby's oxygen saturation dropped from like 95 percent down to like 80 percent while her baby was wearing the nested bean sleep sack pajamas and she said um god strike her dead when she unzipped the nested bean weighted sleep sack off of her baby and remove the weight off the baby's chest that the baby's oxygen saturation on the owlet monitor jumped back up to 95% or whatever it normally was. So after I watched that video and then she said, well, of course I threw my nested bean pajamas in the trash and then I called all my friends and told them to throw their nested bean pajamas in the trash. Um, so after I saw that YouTube video, I guess it kind of freaked me out a little bit about Philip wearing the nested bean pajamas because I didn't buy the little owlet monitor that measures the baby's oxygen saturation so i don't know if when philip wears the nested bean pajamas if his oxygen saturation if it drops at all because we don't have the little baby ankle ankle monitor that measures the oxygen of the tv so yeah so sometimes we let him sleep in the nested bean pajamas even though I watched that YouTube video of that one lady that said uh, her baby's oxygen saturation dropped 
on the owlet monitor when her baby slept in the nested bean pajamas. But I'm not gonna lie, seeing that other woman, that other mother's YouTube video and her saying, I threw my nested bean weighted sleep sacks in the trash and I called all my friends and told them to throw their uh, nested bean pajamas in the trash too. It kind of freaked me out a little bit because I wouldn't want the weight in the little chicken on the nested bean pajamas to make Chibi suffocate or make it hard for him to breathe. Uh, but I did spend a lot of money on those nested bean pajamas. I think I bought like four or five. I think I bought like six of those nested bean weighted sleep sack pajamas, but this Hudson baby sleep sack doesn't have the weighted chicken on the front of it. So I'm not paranoid about putting Philip in this nice little Hudson baby non-weighted sleep sack at night. And Philip slept like almost eight hours and 20 minutes, yeah. So Philip slept eight hours and 20 minutes last night and he wasn't even wearing uh, the nested bean weighted sleep sack. He's just wearing uh, the Hudson Baby non-weighted pajamas and he slept good in this uh, sleep sack with this little long sleeve shirt underneath. And we're just waking up. We're just now waking up, Chibi. I'm gonna set Chibi in the center here. And we just wake up and we started filming almost immediately. I woke up and I snuck in the kitchen before Chibi was awake. And I think I ate three or four Reese chocolates for breakfast. Super healthy. I know I should have eaten oatmeal. Maybe tomorrow I will eat oatmeal for breakfast try to start eating healthier than Reese's chocolates, but I really like Reese's chocolates. <laughs> I don't know why I just love Reese's. But yeah, I think oatmeal is supposed to be good for breast milk production, so maybe tomorrow morning, maybe I'll set a bowl out. Oh wait, I have some special overnight oats. Uh, that I got off the Magica website. They're like, it's like special oatmeal for breastfeeding moms that um, is like Galactagog oatmeal. So maybe I'll set like a bowl out on our kitchen counter um, and just write a note to myself, like put a little post-it note and put eat oatmeal for breakfast eat the Magica lactation oatmeal tomorrow for tomorrow. That way I remember when I'm half asleep that I plan to eat the Magica lactation oatmeal that I bought <clears throat> on the Magica breastfeeding mom website. So I don't forget and eat the Reese's chocolates again. Yeah, I feel like I just eat kind of randomly. I don't really have a meal plan, I just, when I wake up, I'm half asleep and I just walk in the kitchen and I guess I just eat the most yummy, delicious uh, dessert item that I can find. Uh, mommy ate the chocolate brownie last night. Uh, uh. Last night, mommy ate the mac and cheese and a chocolate brownie. Okay. Yes. And sometimes we eat a ham sandwich and I love to tickle. So we don't really have a plan for today yet of what we're going to do. We're going to probably wash a load of laundry. Let's throw the, I threw the Hudson baby uh, pajamas over there and we're going to wash the laundry. We're going to go ahead and I'll probably wash a load of laundry right now, get that started so we can so I can wash the laundry. That'll take an hour and then throw the clean clothes in the dryer. That way we can uh, knock out the laundry early today. 
and maybe hang up the clothes while we still have energy. Before daddy come home, yes. Maybe don't do as much bird watching since, uh, since you guys don't like the bird videos as much. Yeah, our bird watching videos only got like 30 views of when we filmed the hairy woodpecker and the tufted titmouse and the, uh, the white breasted nuthatch. So maybe YouTube only want to see mommy and Chibi. I think we get more views on the videos of just me and Philip uh, playing. And of course the breastfeeding videos get a lot of views. And I wanted to talk to you guys about why uh, mommy disabled the comments on our YouTube channel. Uh, I disabled the comments on our YouTube channel because almost every single comment was just like people saying like, we only want to see the breastfeeding videos. We don't care about the birds. We don't care about the pillowcases, the silk pillowcases. We don't care about the mattress toppers. We only want to see the breastfeeding videos only please. So since all the comments were just saying, we only want to see the breastfeeding videos, that's why I decided to just disable the comments on every video. So sorry that a few people run the comments uh, for everyone. Because we would like to receive the comments, but I'm just really busy, I guess, and... We're new at this YouTube thing, so I don't know really how to review the comments. And I probably don't even have the time because we would probably get hundreds of comments. And a lot of them might be the weird little spam comments. We were getting a lot of spam comments that were just like random website links to weird websites or all those comments that said we only want to watch breastfeeding videos. So. Mommy just disabled the comments. Uh, yeah. So yeah. I mean, we'll do we'll do some breastfeeding videos. We know you guys like to watch the the breastfeeding videos. Uh, I know a lot of people. When I accidentally leave the comments on, they say more breastfeeding videos, please. I guess it's just a little bit awkward. It's just a little awkward for me to film the breastfeeding videos. I'm sure you can tell that I look a little awkward. Uh, I, I just feel like it's a little weird, maybe. <laughs> I didn't want that really to be the focus of our, of our YouTube channel. We do do the exclusive breastfeeding all day. Um, uh, it's just a little bit weird. Uh, I don't know, for me to film the videos. Um, yeah. We see the little squirrels outside, Chibi. Okay, I'm gonna change Chibi diapy. We're gonna change his little diapy. We're gonna scoop him up and we're gonna change his little diapy. Okay, lay down, sweet one. All right, I'm gonna change Philip's diapy. Uh, I gotta get, uh, let me go grab the tripod really quick. We just woke up. I'm gonna go grab our tripod, my iPhone 12 tripod, and I still have to put the pictures, uh, the pictures I ordered on the Snapfish app in the picture album uh, to mail to my daughter Lucy at the post office. I got Lucy this little photo album that says live, laugh, love. So I picked out 32 pictures and I think this album holds 160 pictures, but maybe I won't fill the photo album completely up. That way um, Lucy could have something to look forward to in the future. I could, uh, leave some pages of the photo album, Lucy's photo album blank maybe. That way 
I could mail Lucy uh, more um, pictures in the future for Lucy to uh, add more photos herself, but Mommy hasn't went through all the pictures yet. And we still have a $7 coupon. It says, uh, Earn $7 Walgreens cash rewards when you spend $25 or more on your next in-store purchase. And the coupon expires on November 21st. So I guess I have to spend $25 to get the $7 off, to use the $7 off coupon. But I don't know what we would need, really, uh, if we went back to Walgreens and it's a kind of long drive. Yeah, so I don't know. Maybe, maybe we could go back to Walgreens and buy a couple more picture albums to give people as Christmas gifts. And then we could use our uh, $7 off uh, coupon. I'm gonna aim this a little high since I'm changing Philip's diaper. Yeah, maybe we could uh, buy a couple more. We could buy a couple more picture albums, and then we could use the seven dollar off coupon. Yeah, I guess it. If you spend twenty five dollars, you kind of get like seven dollars off. Uh, so seven dollars off is a pretty good, yeah. significant coupon. I can't remember how much. That one picture album was, I think, it, oh, I have the receipt. I can see. And they only had one picture album. Uh, the picture album was, oh, it was $14.99, so. Okay. So I just now looked at the receipt and Lucy's picture hey. album was $15, it was $14.99. So if we bought two picture albums at Walgreens today or tomorrow, that would be $30. So we would hit the $25 coupon and then we would get $7 off. So that's $30 minus $7 coupon. Uh, I don't like to think about math early in the morning. Let's see, $30. Uh, minus seven dollars, let's just say minus ten dollars. Seven is almost ten. That's like twenty-two dollars, right? I don't know. Yeah, I think thirty minus, I think two just took, I think thirty minus seven is twenty-two, maybe? Uh, I don't know. Maybe it's 22. Yeah, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. No, it's 23. I almost did math right. So it only, if I spent $30 on two more picture albums, we would only have to pay $23 for two picture albums instead of $30. So that's pretty good, and I think uh, picture albums would make a wonderful Christmas gift uh, to give somebody uh, as a present, you know. Some family pictures might be nice. People might enjoy looking at a picture album as a Christmas gift. But last time we went to Walgreens uh, a few days ago, like, Two days ago they only had the one picture album and I bought that picture album for my daughter Lucy but we didn't go to the post office yet because I remember we got kind of burnt out after we went to the Walgreens to pick up the pictures that I paid for and then we got the the photo album for Lucy as part of one of Lucy's Christmas gifts and then we got uh, a four by six picture frame for someone. 
and as a Christmas gift and we got another picture frame. I think the picture frame was $6.99. We got another picture frame that holds two four by six pictures. And I kind of wanted to go to the United States Post Office and mail the double four by six picture frame to my sweet mom uh, for her Christmas gift. Uh, but we haven't went to the post office yet, partly because yesterday I just decided we would stay home, take a little break, because we went out the previous day. Um, so maybe we'll look through the 150 pictures I picked up from Walgreens and we'll put some of Lucy's pictures in her picture album. And then after I put the pictures in Lucy's picture album, we will have everything we need to mail to Lucy uh, for her Christmas gift. But my boyfriend decided to rip up, um, my boyfriend decided to rip up the one painting that mommy had originally planned to mail to Lucy just because I thought it might be nice to mail Lucy one of my boyfriend's beautiful watercolor paintings. Um, but he ripped up that watercolor painting because daddy didn't feel like that watercolor painting was, was good enough. It was just like that little watercolor painting of the shed or the barn at sunrise. So daddy said, no, don't mail Lucy that painting. I don't think it's good enough. He said, that was just a scrap painting. So he ripped it up and he threw that painting in the trash that I filmed a couple days ago. He said, I'm gonna paint Lucy something better than that little uh, shed painting. And if he does paint Lucy a new painting, uh, it might take him a little while to paint it I don't know how long it takes daddy to do his watercolor paintings and daddy is kind of busy. But maybe if he painted Lucy, he asked what kind of painting he should do for Lucy. And I said that maybe he should, it's okay. Maybe some kind of like Disney painting. Um, maybe a Disney princess painting. Maybe like, he did a really cool, Daddy did a really cool Aladdin painting. Uh, and it had a magical flying carpet. So maybe like an Aladdin painting, she would probably, I think Lucy would probably like that. Okay, we changed his little diaper. And we're gonna button up all the buttons. Are we gonna button up those buttons? Let's count the buttons. Okay, Philip, are you ready for the count of buttons? Philip, one button, two buttons, three buttons, four buttons. Okay, what about five buttons? Five buttons. Six buttons, seven buttons. Uh, if I can get it, seven buttons. Okay, I can't get the seventh button. Okay, seven buttons, eight buttons, nine buttons. Crazy one. Nice. We got all nine buttons. And I'm gonna get that little chibi. I got the little chibi. I got the little chibi. I got the little chibi. I got little chibi. Good chibi chibi. We just woke up. And we did how many? Nine buttons? Uh, I think my mom. 
Just now sent us a text message. <laughs> yes, in this YouTube video. Uh -huh. Hi. This YouTube video is at 30 minutes. Let's sit right here. I think we need to take sweet little Philip in the bedroom and lay him down and do some more uh, exclusive breastfeeding. Yeah, we better breastfeed that buddy. Let's go on a little Zoom adventure. Okay, it's a heavy one. We'll throw away that diaper later. Come on, we're gonna go on a little Zoom adventure and do some more breastfeeding. And we got a package last night that I didn't even open yet. Uh, I think it's just like some baby hangers. Yeah, we got a package. And I think it's the baby hangers. Come on, sweet one. We're going to have a good day today. And I'm going to sneak you around here. We got to wash that A-frame ceiling. We're going to lay that one down on the bed. And we're going to breastfeed that baby one. Okay, we lay that little baby one down. And that's a cute one, sweet one, happy one. And we're going to put the camera right here. And we're going to do the little hey. breastfeeding. A little breastfeeding video here because remember all the comments said that they only wanted to watch the breastfeeding videos that's okay chibi so you can see how i breastfeed this baby one no 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 it's okay i know you really want the milk i'm gonna open up our blinds uh, to get some natural sunshine. So let some natural sunshine in our bedroom. And where's this is my Timber Pudic pillow? Mommy like the Timber Pudic pillow. There we go. We're gonna breastfeed that baby one, Cubby. Come on, we sleep at once. Okay, I do not want to edit this video, so. Maybe I'm going to hide the breastfeeding slightly in case we have any slip-ups. That way I don't have to edit this thing. Okay. I think we got the breastfeeding situation blocked a little bit. Yep. I think that's good. Turn around, Jimmy. Yep. That way I don't have to edit this video. Uh, come on, turn around. of the breastfeeding situation but it is a nightmare to edit the uh, breastfeeding videos especially that Ware Farm National Historic Park breastfeeding video because I was wearing that little blue feather breastfeeding blanket and Philip was just jerking that little breastfeeding blanket all around. I don't think Philip likes feeling that little blue feather breastfeeding scarf on his face while I'm breastfeeding him because he just jerked that little blanket all around at the wear farm. And I had to edit that YouTube video like crazy. So we're still doing the breastfeeding video that everybody comments about wanting to see. But mommy blocks the breastfeeding with the pillows this time. So that we don't have to edit this video at all. 
I feel like editing these YouTube videos can be very time consuming. So this video I'm not going to rewatch before we post it on YouTube. I'm just going to straight up post it like it is raw and unedited. Um, I'm sure it'll be just fine. It's okay. He is drinking the yummy milk. And then I'm going to drink some water. Because I can tell I'm dehydrated after going to sleep and breastfeeding Philip. And then uh, just waking up. So mommy is definitely going to drink a bunch of the essential water after we get done breastfeeding this morning. This is the second time I have breastfed Philip this morning. My gray hair roots look amazing. They look just plain awesome, don't they? Yeah, so my, the roots of my hair are still gray. But that's why they sell hair dye. So maybe mommy just needs to go to the hair salon and get her hair dyed. Maybe I should do that today because my gray roots of my hair, uh, they do not look very aesthetically appealing. Those are my two favorite words, aesthetically appealing, lol. I'm trying to relax. They say that you produce the most breast milk when you are relaxed and thinking about your baby and focusing on your sweet little baby. I'm not going to lie though, sometimes when I've been doing this exclusive breastfeeding, like just like a couple times out of the whole five months that I've been breastfeeding, there were a couple days that I was like, well, what if I don't want to relax? You know, you probably think it's funny. Yeah, I guess there were a couple days that I was just like, what if I don't want to be relaxed the whole day, you know? What if I want to frolic around, but if you're a breastfeeding mom, you just have to tell yourself, like, I have to be relaxed when I breastfeed, you know? <laughs> well, what if I don't want to be relaxed all day? What if I want to frolic? <laughs> But if you love your baby, you'll be relaxed all day with your baby. We were going to go to the to the thrift store near our house to look for some picture frames and some picture albums just to see what stuff is at the thrift store near us.
Maybe we could go to the thrift store today. We'll have to see after we get woken up a little bit better. I found the address of the thrift store near us. And we still have to buy quite a few Christmas gifts. And maybe we'll find a few more Christmas gifts for Lucy. If we go to the thrift store, I don't know. Have any of you guys started doing your Christmas shopping yet? You guys getting ready for the Christmas holidays? I guess Thanksgiving is coming up really soon too. And we are going to be traveling for Thanksgiving as uh, most people probably are. Okay, mommy fixed the shirt. And we're gonna move the little pillow so you can see sweet little Philip. That is a cute, cute, super cute. <laughs> oh, it's okay. I think you might want to breastfeed some more. I think that sweet little pillow, buddy. I think you want some more milk. And I think he gets a little bit. I think he gets a little bit upset if I talk. Well, I'm breastfeeding him because for some reason he likes it kind of quiet. Uh, it's okay. He likes it kind of quiet uh, when he's breastfeeding. Uh, That's a cute one. And I need to drink some more water anyways. Oh, uh, a Look at him. <sighs> he gets mad when I talk to my mom on the phone while I'm breastfeeding. He gets a, he gets a little bit upset sometimes. What's, oh, that was a big burp, sweet one. Look at that one. Mommy loves this one. He's a cute little one. You want to bounce around? He wants to bounce around. You did so good sleeping for 8 hours and 20 minutes last night. That was awesome. He sleeps all night, almost every night. Can you say, can you say, hi? Can you say, can you say, hey? Okay, mommy has to drink some water. I can tell I'm like really dehydrated. Uh, that's probably why my lips are cracked too. Let me set sweet little Phillip right here and I'm going to get my little essential water bottle. Oh, I'm running out of the essential water. It's like this fancy alkaline water. I'm gonna get a drink. I'm still not completely awake yet. And it's been 43 minutes I've been recording this video. So I'm gonna get a little bit of water and we're gonna, we're gonna pep it up. We're gonna pep it up a little bit. The birds were pepped up when I went out there to the kitchen. Are you watching mommy? Are you smiling? Mommy need to scoot it back a little bit. We need to scoot it back a little bit. And we're gonna twist our camera right around here so you can see the beautiful forest behind us. The beautiful forest. There you go, sweet one. Are you looking outside? I can tell all the trees are turning orange and beautiful golden colors. It almost looks like a blazing, crackling uh, bonfire or a fire, the color of the window. It's that beautiful fire color of oranges and yellows since it's 
fall right now. November. We've got the Thanksgiving forest design behind us. I see all the little cars out there zooming on the street. Saw a little red car that was going very fast. Everyone's frolicking. Maybe we could frolic too. We could go to the thrift store while we still can think straight since we just woke up and we could go thrift store shopping. We just gotta get the diapy bag, which it's already packed and I'm breastfeeding. So just bring me and Philip. Maybe grab my purse. Yeah. Just get the purse, the diapy bag, uh, Philip's little bear jacket, a little warm bear fuzzy jacket. And we get the keys out of mommy purse and we go zoom zoom. Oh, we could go to the post office too. But if we go to the post office, then I have to put Lucy's pictures in her picture album. Okay, mommy drank a little bit of water. And I can get some more water later. Okay. We'll throw this over there. And let's go ahead and get... I'm gonna go ahead and grab Lucy's picture album. And I might need to put Philip in the bouncy seat uh, while I put the pictures in the picture album. Or I could lay him down, but I think... He kind of wants to sit up. So maybe I'll put Philip in the bouncy. Or I could try to lay him down. Because then I would have to turn the camera off, I think, if I ran to grab the bouncy seat. So I'll just lay him down and Mommy will get him a couple toys. Mommy is going to get okay. Philip uh, a couple toys. We're going to get the little toys. I'm going to get him his new toys, his Yoda toy and his Elmo toy, and his Cookie Monster toy. I'm gonna get him three toys. So he can play with the toys while Mommy puts uh, Lucy's pictures in Lucy's picture album. I gave him the little Elmo toy and the little Yoda toy, and I got the picture album right here for Lucy. And I got the 32 pictures we picked, and I gotta go get the other two. I gotta go get the other two piles of the pictures um, to go through these new pictures to see um, if we want to send Lucy some more pictures. Yeah. Okay, I got all the pictures. So we're going to go back in the bedroom with the sweet, sweet one. If we go somewhere, I might want to take a shower, although I don't look too terrible. I usually like to take my showers at night um, after Daddy gets home. Uh, that way Daddy can watch Sweet One. Um, so yeah, that way I don't have to put Sweet in the bouncy seat while I take a shower. That way at least he can hang out with Daddy so I'm not... Uh, ignoring him. Okay. Oh no, my tripod on my iPhone broke. Let's just snap it back in there. I was trying to boost you up a little bit, but that's fine. Okay, so I got this double picture frame uh, to send to my mom. So I guess I got to open up this Four by six picture frame. Philip is playing with his little Yoda toy. He likes his new little Yoda toy. <laughs> this is a really nice toy. I think there's a toy store near our house, and he got another new toy. It's a Tickle Me Elmo. 
Did it tickle me, Elmo? It laughs. So he's got, and he's got the cookie monster. He's got the cookie monster. Okay, get the toys. Okay, so we gotta open up this picture, picture frame. That's a cute one. Here, let me show you Philip, so you can see Philip too. So you can see both of us. That's okay, Philip. Uh, we gotta look at the pictures. Is that Madeline? He'd be okay. He just breastfed, so he's okay. Mommy will hold you. Let me hold you. <clears throat> He's a little bit of a fussy one. We just changed his diaper though. Mommy hold this one and we gotta film you too, sweet one. There we go. And mommy opened up the It's okay, Kev one, sweet one, happy one. Okay, we opened up uh, that picture frame and we have to pick pick a picture. Uh, to send to my mom, to send to grandma. So these are Lucy's pictures. Uh, and those are going to go in Lucy's picture album. I don't know who I bought this 4x6 picture for. It's okay! Uh, we'll give this to somebody. We'll, when we start looking at the pictures, we'll figure out which pictures um, we're going to put in there. Look at that sweet one. That is my beautiful, 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 beautiful one. And then when we were at Walgreens a couple days ago, I just asked them if they could uh, give me some empty uh, Walgreens envelopes uh, in case we wanted to give any family members some pictures. Okay, let's get the pictures out here, buddy. Okay, mommy got the pictures out. Okay. And which pictures are we gonna give to Lucy? Well, I guess I need to look at which pictures we already picked for Lucy. That's a cute little buddy. I feel like you can't really see Philip that well, but. Okay, let's look at the pictures, Philip. Okay, Philip. Uh, there's some pictures of you. Ah, you're squirming? That's a squirmy little one in the morning. And he's gonna get tired out and he's gonna take a little nap. <gasps> Look at the pictures, Philip. Okay, there's some pictures. Oh, and here's some more pictures. And so we're just gonna look at the pictures and uh, we only picked 32 for Lucy and Lucy's picture album holds. Uh, 160 pictures, so maybe we'll send Lucy some more pictures and we're going to take them. And I placed another picture order on the Snapfish app. Mommy placed another order oh, let me take a on the Snapfish app. Yes. I think maybe we should, while I look through these pictures, maybe we should put Philip in his Disney activity <laughs> bouncer thing uh because sometimes he likes to after he breastfeeds in the morning he likes to kind of get some of his energy out and bounce around in the disney activity uh bouncer walker thing um and then he'll bounce around for like 10 or 15 minutes and uh then he will get sleepy and he will take a nap in the morning so i think he is ready to bounce around and frolic in the disney activity bouncy so i'm going to take philip over to his disney bouncy so i can put these pictures in the picture album the disney bouncy thing is like an extra set of hands that is a big strong one mommy love the sweet one mommy love the sweet one come on Sweet one, happy one. Okay, let's put Philip over here. I hope this thing does not fall. And I think you can almost see the Disney bouncy thingy. And this is what Philip likes to bounce around in. 
and he likes to bounce around in the Disney uh, bouncer thing to get the little energies out. We gotta be careful because there's a stingray. Let's get those little feet in that little bouncy. Hold on. One foot in this one. And one foot in the other one. Cutie, get one foot in this one. You gotta turn around, cutie. It's really hard to get them in this thing. Ah, I need that little feet. The little feet. Yeah, it's a little bit difficult to get them to sit down in this thing. Okay, we're gonna get those to be in there. Oh, we got them in it. Now I'm gonna twist him around a little bit. Can you do them? I just twisted him around in the Disney bouncy thingy. Uh, cause I'm scared he's gonna bounce really high. Turn around. And accidentally hit his head on this stingray thing. Because the stingray thing is kind of curved down a little bit. Okay. So we're going to bring... Uh, well, we could bring the pictures in here so Philip could bounce around in the sunshine. Yeah, I'll move Philip uh, over here towards the sunshine so he can get some natural sunlight while he's bouncing around. Philip, are you going to show him what you look like in your Disney bouncy thing? He loves his Disney bouncy thing. And if you like this uh, Dis baby Disney play center, bouncy play center, I will post a link in this YouTube video's description to where you can buy this exact same uh, Disney Baby Bouncy Activity Center in my YouTube video's description, but I did my baby shower registry at on the Target app, so I think someone purchased this for us as a baby shower gift on the Target app or on the Target website, so I think you can get this Disney Baby Activity Center on the Target app or on the Target website. So I'll post a link to the Target website where you can buy this fun little Disney Activity uh, Center for your baby. And it makes little sounds and a little turtle lights up. I don't know if you can see. It makes little sounds and he can press the buttons and have a fun time. It has a little mirror and it has a little fish you can spin too. I like to come over here and spin the fish. Hey, look at the fish! It has a little Nemo fish. It has the sharks. And you can hang stuff from the stingray, little, little stars, and they can have a fun time. So, seahorse. Okay, I'm gonna go get the uh, pictures. My tripod on my iPhone keeps randomly like breaking in the back. I don't know why. Okay, so we're just gonna go in the bedroom and get uh, the picture frame uh, that we're gonna mail to my mom, my sweet mom. And we're gonna get Lucy's um, picture album. And I did not start washing uh, dirty clothes yet, but it almost looks like there's not a lot of dirty clothes, yeah. Yeah, there's not that many dirty clothes you can see are dirty clothes. Usually I have to wash laundry every day, but I guess maybe since I washed a couple loads of laundry yesterday, then we can wait till tomorrow to wash the laundry, which I hate washing laundry anyways. Let's come over near the natural sunlight here. And we're gonna bring the, the picture frames. I'm gonna get some more water too. I feel like I'm so dehydrated doing the, doing the exclusive breastfeeding. Do you like our cottage in the woods? 
I love this house. I completely love this house. I think I definitely have a strong emotional connection to this house since this is the house that we brought sweet little Philip home to from the hospital in on June 1st we came here okay I got some of the pictures and we're gonna go get the rest of the pictures we want while you bounce around in the sunshine my mom told me she was like you need to get some foundation and you need to get some lipstick and wear some lipstick. And actually I ordered some lipstick on the MAC Cosmetics website, but the lipstick still hasn't arrived yet. And I think I got some kind of weird email from the MAC Cosmetics makeup website that said like they just returned my lipstick to the sender, which was the MAC Cosmetics. I don't know why they would mail it to me, mail me the lipstick and then send it back. But if they did do that, then maybe the lipstick was not meant to be, because I don't wear makeup anyways. So maybe it just wasn't meant to be for me to wear the lipstick. And we're gonna get Lucy's picture album set up today. Just gonna throw these dikies somewhere and get some room over here to uh, do the picture thingy. There's some nice little flower designs. Okay, so we have to pick two pictures uh, for my mom to frame for my mom. I'm gonna have to move you over a little bit and boost you up, I think. Yeah, we're just gonna, I'm just gonna look through uh, the pictures here and pick two pictures to mail to my beautiful mother. Um, and I think the pictures that I have to pick need to be, um, they need to be rotated. Let me look at this picture frame. Oh, okay, so the picture frame, I'm gonna know my mom sits up like this. So the pictures that we need to pick to put in the picture frame to mail to my mom need to be in the horizontal uh, rotation. So this one is a super cute picture, but it's not horizontal. And uh, this picture I'm gonna send to one of our family members. We're gonna send this picture, these pictures to Grammy, to my boyfriend's Grammy. That's a cute one. I like that one. And I like this one. That's Philip giggling with his cookie monster. That's a cute one. I want to keep some of these pictures. I'm not going to show you all of the pictures. Um, because I don't know if some of our family members might not want to be YouTube superstars like us, lol. So uh, I'll just show you the ones of me and Philip and Daddy. I like this little picture. That's a cute picture. I printed a lot of pictures. I went wild. Philip is going wild in his Disney activity bouncy thingy. Let's see, is that a duplicate? I think it's a duplicate. That might be a cute one for my mom. I don't know, I'll keep, I'll keep looking. There's Philip smiling. We hear the little doggy woofing outside right now. Let's see here. So I'm trying to pick two pictures to frame to uh, mail to my mom. Oh, there's a cute picture of me and Philip. I might put one pile to keep. 
And maybe one pile. I love this picture. Philip, look at him. He's excited. Uh, we'll put one pile that's the vertical orientation. And we'll put one pile that we're going to keep. I'm going to keep that one. Maybe I could set these pictures down. I'll put this little frame. we got to keep this frame in mind. And then i got to get those picture envelopes. And maybe we could just, like, write people's names with a Sharpie on the envelopes of pictures that we want to give to a certain person for Christmas. So I'm just going to get a Sharpie. Let's see. I know that. Oh, I see a Sharpie right now. I'm going to go get it. And I'm going to go ahead and post this YouTube video, and then I'll just record a continuation video um, of the rest of our day today. So please click like, and please subscribe to our YouTube channel. Like I said, this is a brand new YouTube channel, so we're trying to get those 4,000 watch hours and 1,000 YouTube subscribers. Um, so help us make our dreams come true, and please click like, and please click subscribe and watch all of our YouTube videos and click on my YouTube videos description if you want to click on the link to the Target website where you can order your sweet little five month old baby, uh, the Disney Activity Bouncy uh, Play Bouncing Apparatus. Click like and click subscribe and have a wonderful day. Bye, we love you.